Hey everybody, how are you all doing? Welcome back to my YouTube channel. If you're here, my name is Sal. And for today's video, guys, I have such a great news for you because I got an invitation to be part of this close collaboration video with this amazing, very talented creator here on YouTube. They're great people, guys. And hopefully after you watch my video, please uh, give your time and support your channel as well, the way you supported me. Go check your channel. I will include all their links down below on my description box. And also, guys, this close collaboration video hosted by Glamour Ellen, my ate, my cousin. Thank you, thank you so much. For today's video, we're going to create another amazing tablescape using a blue and white Shinwazuri Shik ginger jar so if you have a ginger jar especially the blue and white they're very classic timeless elegance it's beautiful i love ginger jar guys and i have a few in my collection and hopefully i can get some more <laughs> to be added in my collection but anyway i cannot wait to start decorating or uh, style our table for today and i hope that you enjoy this video and let me know comment down below what you think and thank you so much for being here once again and supporting my channel and now let's go ahead and start our tablescape. First of all, if you may not familiar of what is a chinoiserie ginger jar, the term chinoiserie comes from the French word chinois or Chinese, denotes that chinoiserie did not in fact come directly from Asia but instead a European interpretation of Asian culture and decorative arts. Porcelain and ceramics are perhaps the most coveted elements of chinoiseries in part because of the skill and craftsmanship required to produce them correctly. So far, I have about 10 in my collection and I purchased most of them from Home Goods and Tuesday Morning. On this tablescape, I added some blue and white candles to create some romantic vibes. And I laid out my white charger and this beautiful blue and white plate that I purchased from Home Goods. As you can see here, for the first time, I am using the pampas grass as my centerpiece. Incorporate dried materials with the shades of white, brown, and beige. I find this pampas grass as an excellent addition to make summer centerpiece as your floral arrangements, like boho style, minimalist, clean look, and more natural. It's also a perfect match with color blue and the effect of this centerpiece could be simple or dramatic. It is also gives that elegance, timeless, from the chinoiserie jar and added the beautiful rustic boho modern farmhouse charm. Ginger jars were primarily functional serving as storage containers for spices in Asian China. When imported to Europe, they took on a more purely aesthetic purpose, appearing as decorative accent all over the home and eventually cementing their reputation as a decor classic. Lost in your eyes, under your spell, oh it's like we've always known. I can already tell all oh, that this feeling is taking over. Can we take our 
our time. I wanna savor every thought on my mind of you and I getting together. The blue and white chinoiserie chic. I like it. It's simple, clean, neutral. What do you think? It's timeless, it's elegant, and I just like the combination of our centerpieces. What do you think of my centerpiece? I use the Papa's grass, and we're in the summer season, officially summer season here in the United States. Also, guys, after you watch my video, please don't forget to check out my description box below because I will include all the links of my other collaboration sisters on this tablescape. Please check out their creation, guys. They are super amazing, very talented. Bye. Mwah.